People with dreadlocks are nasty. They're unclean. Have you ever seen these colored people walking up and down the street with dreadlocks or locks or whatever you want to call it? And have you ever wondered, how does these colored people get their hair like that? Well, let me tell you guys something. There's a lot of stereotypes about dreadlocks, and the stereotypes are true. People with dreadlocks are nasty. People with dreadlocks suffer from personal hygiene. They stink, they don't shower, and they don't wash their, their, wash their nasty hair. Me, personally, I can't stand dreadlocks. Whenever I see a nasty colored person with that nasty, stinking dreadlocks in their hair, I want to puke. I want a pukeness because it's disgusting. That looks so antisocial. It looks so primitive. It looks so like jungle. Half of these people you see walking around with dreadlocks, they look like they just came up from the jungle. They look nasty, they look filthy, and they look uncivilized. You know, one time I was talking to a guy, and this guy had dreadlocks. And this guy here, ha, this guy head smelled so damn stink. Nasty and stink. I wanted to throw up. I wanted to vomit. That's how nasty it is. I think dreadlocks should become illegal. And people with dreadlocks need to cut their hair. It's nasty. It's filthy. It's the most despicable thing I've ever seen. And I know a lot of people are asking themselves, do they wash their hair? No. I'll be honest with you guys. People with dreadlocks do not wash their hair. People with dreadlock, dreadlocks suffer from personal hygiene. And people with dreadlocks are not clean. You know what I saw in this girl one time? This girl had dreadlocks. You know what I saw in her hair? I saw a cockroach. I saw a bird nest. And her hair smelled like bat doo doo. Like bat doo doo. It's, it, it's ew. It's ew. Ew, illness. I hate dreadlocks. Emancipate yourselves from mental slavery. None but ourselves can free our minds.